I'm here with Rianne from the Uplifting Clinic. Um, firstly, congratulations on your award. Thank you very much. We're very honoured. So can you begin by telling us a bit about your clinic? Yeah, sure. So uh, we have an, a medical aesthetics clinic in Barry in South Wales. Um, it provides all sorts of things from aesthetics treatments like botulinum toxin, anti-wrinkle injections, dermal fillers, skin treatments, through to more well, well-being stuff like massage and reflexology. And what, are you, what would be your main treatments right now? What are the most popular treatments that people are going for? Uh, probably uh, the medical aesthetics, so the botulinum, bo Botox for short, and the dermal fillers. And when it comes to medical um, aesthetics, um, how important is the, the equipment and the facilities to get the, the desired results? Well, it, it is very important actually. So uh, botulinum toxin is actually a prescription only medicine. So you have to have a prescribing license to get it. And you have to get it from a pharmacy to have the, the correct product. And in the UK, actually, there are only three available. Um, Bocature, branded Botox and Azalor. And they all they're all very, very similar. We prefer Bocature because it doesn't require cold chain to transport. Um, so practicality wise, it's much easier. Um, with the dermal fillers, they aren't prescription only, so you can get them anywhere, you can get them online if you wish, but we tend to get them from reputable pharmacies um, because at the end of the day you are injecting something into somebody's face um, and what you inject is really important. The fillers vary in type, so for example the lip would require a more pliable soft filler, whereas the cheek or the chin might need something more firm, structural, so it's very client dependent what filler we choose, if that makes sense. Yeah, of course. And in terms of the cosmetic and the massage uh, treatments, um, are there particular brands that you work with? Uh, we use Talgo, which is a nice French company for facial stuff and, um, and various other treat massage treatments and things like that. And we have a lady called Kim who's just joined us. She provides the reflexology massage treatments and she actually blends her own oils and she makes her own candles and things like that very much using aromatherapeutic remedies so it's quite holistic okay excellent and are there any plans for the future oh yes of course <laughs> um, our plan is to hopefully become registered with health inspectorate wales the reason for that is that we would like to start providing and supporting the nhs with some medical services and you have to be registered of course to do that so we would like to start maybe providing some blood testing so we would need to work with the laboratory to to organize that uh, maybe some private general practice so i'm a gp by trade so some private general practice um services uh earwax removal additionally and possibly some um providing medicals for taxi drivers and hgv drivers because i'm aware that they find it difficult to get in with the nhs gps at the moment because they're so busy Okay, and one final question. You mentioned um, the aesthetic treatments and the medical treatments. So um, if you've got a big date on the diary, so perhaps a wedding, how far in advance should we get in touch? <laughs> well, of course, any injectable could cause bruising or swelling. So it's sensible to at least be a month or so before a big day like a wedding. Um, your botulinum toxin lasts about three months. So with that in mind, if somebody was having it for the first time, I'd say at least six months before, try it to see if you like the end result. And then to have it a couple of, well, about six weeks before the wedding for the final result, because it will last then for that event. Um, with dermal filler, it depends which filler again you're having, but they can last nine to 12 months sometimes. So you've got a bit more room there to play with. And I'd certainly recommend at least six weeks maybe two months before a wedding or a big event to have especially lip filler done um, but any filler really okay fantastic congratulations again thank on your you. award thank you very much